Hello and welcome back to my Planet Crafter Let's Play. I'm Drake Artisan. Uh, last episode we found that missing component that we were uh, needing to continue with the Warden's Key quest. Uh, we also found the missing worm. Um, so we got the uh, pink butterflies now. Um, I'm going to continue that um, with doing something a little different. Uh, we unlocked um, the tier three um, tree spreaders. Um, also, we have the teleporter now. Uh, so we're going to be making good use of those, I think, on uh, this one. Uh, let's start off by putting down, because I really want to get these. Um, oh, I want to get these plant life things going, so don't want it inside my base either so I'm trying to find a good spot here so let's just put it here and we'll put in a 350 and eat that I've already grabbed the keys for the warden's key uh, and then the high quality food um, I want to put down a few more uh, tea um, threes so um, let me show you inside first what I've done, or I guess outside of the port. Uh, here's a torch on this one. Uh, so you guys know that I, I did the uh, fertilizer uh, here, and then got the sulfur chest there. Uh, I also set up uh, for bio nugs here. Let me drop the torch so you guys can see. There you go. Um, so we have some bio dugs, so it's pulling from the two eggplants and then I have a rubber one over here and then it's pulling from, um, these two waters, which share a water for the bacteria. So that's where we're at on that. Let me also show you, I have set this up with two silkworm plots and this is doing fabric. So it's pulling from those and doing fabric. I have now a full thing of Iona and fabric. So yeah, we have that going for us. So I'm just gonna stick that in there. Um, I, a lot, this is overflow. So um, I've also set up and expanded an area over here. Um, and put down a new um, um, fusion generator. Um, and then I have these three crafters over here doing the rods. I know there's an osmium rod coming up, but I'm a little ways away from that. So all my excess now, I'm dumping in here, um, like my super alloys, uranium, iridium, and then aluminum. Um, so I'm dumping it in here. That way I don't have to worry about it. I don't have to craft it. So, uh, we have a few um, I collected earlier, so we'll just dump that. And we'll dump that. We'll do that. And, yep, that's kind of where we're at. Um, so we want to continue the Warden's Key. Is that light now? Tell you what, let me pause, put down a couple more T2s, and then we will be right back. It won't take me very long to collect it, so hold on. And just like that, we have some T3 and some growth. So, um, I did, um... I want to show you guys. I put some more rockets. They're at 4,000 now. So I've got four of each uh, up in the air. And we're also showing the drone one. So when we get the drones, we'll be able to see that. And I'll also show you where we're at on the terraformation. And we are unlimited O2. Breathable atmosphere now. So that is pretty cool. And that's going to make exploring a lot easier. And I don't know if you guys can see, but these now are T3 plants and grow. So, um, 
pretty excited um, to do that now. Now, we need to go to 1565, 109, 2500. So, uh, it looks like we're headed that direction. So 1565, 100. Um, it's going down. Looks like we're going this way. All right. So let's go over here and see if we can find. Um, the Borden's Key stuff. Now that I have breathable O2 and I have the water I can just drink. I can drink straight from here now. As soon as I get it. All I need to do is bring some food. I've been thinking about it. I should probably go ahead and do a water bottle just in case. I'm like exploring some kind of space. But, oh, um, something else I did do is I moved the uranium since we're almost to the uranium area. Where's that? It's over here. Let's go over here. Um, so I moved the ore extractor of the uranium out of the cave down to here and it is picking up uranium. So thank you for that hint, my precious viewers. Very much appreciate that one. So now I'm not running inside. So 1500, 1565 is this way right there. And we need, should be up in here somewhere. Is this another cave? Oh, there's a chest. Oh, it's empty. Um, should be up here somewhere. Come on, where are you at? Cave or something? Uh, we'll wait on those. Oh, looky here. This is a interesting space. Hmm. There's a three. Open. What? I thought it was going to be a doorway. <laughs> Kind of a we're terraforming now. Oh, I guess we've always been terraforming, huh? That's interesting. Very, very interesting. What kind of new adventures are you gonna lead me on today, Warden's Key? See the light. This is kind of cool. So we gotta go down into a cave. All right, I'm going, nope, we're in a canyon. Then drink some water. Oh, what the? What the monkeys? Oh, I missed it. Oh, there's an altar. Is there anything over here? Be sure I don't miss anything. Um, I'm climbing up a tree. I'm in a tree. I think I'm in a tree. I don't see a doorway there. Wow. This is pretty cool. Well, let's start here at the very front and work our way around. Oops. As soon as I learn how to stay on, right? 
What is that? Ah, I nabbed it. Come on. Just gotta watch my food now. It's the only thing. We got water in here, so. Uh, let's keep following this up. Let's see. What do we got going on here? What do we have? Nothing there. I guess we're going up some more. Wow. This thing just keeps on going. Let's just keep going up. Aha. All right. I don't see any coordinates. And I gotta be careful. 1200. That butterfly does a 1200% multiplier. Uh -huh. We gotta find more of those bugs. Is that it? Can't go anywhere else? Well, I got one key. Ooh, parkour. Park parkour. 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 What's over here? Parkour. Parkour. I'm not really parkouring, guys walking around the edge um, until I run to the spot I can't see did I fall down <laughs> wow oh 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 there's another one up there oh, let's come back for that you see you gotta nab it right climb that was a quick way up Right. Nothing there. Water wheels down there. Okay, I guess we're going down. Let's go. Anything hidden? Like golden chest? Where is my guy going? Hey, yo. I don't want to jump. Cause... Yeah. I only brought the one thing of food. Right, let's go this way. Let's go this way. No doors yet. Hmm. Hum, 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 hum. Okay. Anything over here? No. Hey, you're missing your legs. No legs. Doesn't continue down. It's uh, just a floating. Let's see here. There's one. That's three. Okay. Is that all? Um, I feel like we should go to that one downstairs area. is here oh 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 maybe we have them all once we lived and then we died five keys two three 
I gotta find two more keys. Two more keys. Alright, let's go to that one downstairs area and see if there's something over here. Yes, you. Okay, nothing there. Uh, there's one. One. I need one more. I need one more. One more. We should get a drink over here. Uh, I'd like to get another drink. There we go. We still gotta find one more. been here hmm let's see I need one more hello where is the other key because I need one more one more key Did we go all the way around over there? I think we did. This is the place we came down. Um, I think we went all the way around because that was uh, like a walkway, right? Okay. So where are we missing one? I'm looking to see if I see something. I don't see anything. That's the way that other stir thing went. There was nothing over here. Hmm. I'm not seeing. Oh, look at there. There's a walkway here. Oh yeah. That was weird. There's nothing here. Ah, uh, darn it. Alright. Oops. Look. Oh, perfect. That was luck. There's nothing around here, right? Okay. That was lucky. And then we didn't even came out here and didn't even see it. Well, I didn't see it. You guys probably seen it. Oh, we got Osmium Rod Blueprint now. And let's stack the other key on top. Dun, dun, dun. Is that an elevator? This is pretty cool. I love the colors. Like the blue and gold. Alright. What ominous things can we find in here? I see glistening light ahead.
What is that? Butterflies? Gold butterflies? Wow. That's cool. That is amazing. Once again, calamity befalls our people. The predictions are correct. The meteor will hit the planet just a few days. The cities we built, the splendors we made will fall. Our arts, traditions, discoveries, and lives will vanish. Once again, the destruction is upon us. This time, we will not flee as we did generations ago. What is the point of running away when demise chases you so vigorously? Our fate is accepted. Being proud of what we are, or what we were, uh, stayed true to our values. Our story will disappear under the ashes of flames and dust, like a butterfly life, beautiful and evanescent. It's time to meet our end. A warden. Gold chest. I like gold chest. 1500. Wow. Let's go ahead and drink the water. Eat the food. Because we're going to deconstruct that one too. Wow. That's pretty cool. Now, is this going to spawn larva? Like, do we get more? How do we get more? Nope, you're uncommon. We need the golden ones. So how do we get golden larva? Can we get golden larva? Are they like the golden seeds, I imagine? Or we can't get any more? Hmm. That's pretty cool. All right. We are off. And no more keys. The end of the warden. Wow. This be pretty cool to build a base. Or come near the buildings. Can we please commandeer buildings? Where's the fun in that, right? Gotta build your own. At least can we get the colors so we could like do like a blue and gold base? I do like those colors. That cobalt blue and the gold. Those are pretty cool. All right. Well, let's go replace um, the one butterflies we have in the one, the pink ones. Let's put the gold ones in. Can't wait till we get butterfly farms. The farm things out there. And then we can have golden butterflies floating. All right. So, back to the base. And then let's talk about what we're going to do. Um, we need to set up... I'm going to go ahead and set up one for the Osmium Rods. Uh, so you guys can see what I did uh, off screen. I just got tired of going back and crafting the extras. And taking all that back. I imagine it'll be a lot better when we get the drone stuff. But right now we don't have drones, so... Dang. Oh, did we get more gold seeds? We did. Let's sort that. We got two more gold sort, uh, seeds. I think we should turn one of those into a tree. Oh, it's so nice not having to refuel all oxygen. But yeah, let's set up for the osmium rods. Uh -huh. And then, because uh, I'm sure before too long, I'm going to need that. And then let's talk, because um, I had a comment in the last episode saying my base is massive. And I should really get to organizing the stuff so I can find things easier. And yes, I agree. Uh, I'm the, probably the one most scatterbrained. So, uh, me knowing things, right now, they're 
it, it started off alphabetical because when you put it in your inventory and then you sort it like gives down the list so that's what I was basing my original inventory with um but uh, as you can see I've got stuff scattered everywhere like it's just I don't have this set up anywhere for the larva we need to do that Let's see can we nothing to decode okay um so that would be nice um, and I can't even drop anything off in there um man I'm gonna put this in here for now oh do we have another one of those we do so let's take that and can't take that one let's take that and take that and drop that take that and drop that back down and then they're all the same there we go and we got the little ship down there so we'll just do this okay um and i also don't have stuff for the rod yet so i need to get that all sorted um, but let's do one thing at a time. Let's clear out my inventory here first. Uh, let's drop the seeds. Let's put the gold seeds in here for now. So I'm going to turn one of those into a tree and then turn it into the flower spreader. So, um, and then let's drop off our seeds. Do we have any squash seeds? We do not. We have eggplant. And mushroom. Oh, no. We want the seeds. There we go. And bean seeds. And I want to go around here. That's the plants. That one's full. That one's full. I haven't done anything for the storages on those. Um, so let's go ahead and take those out. And do that. And take out the tree bark. And put that there. And then sort that. Um, butterflies. Let's take these 800s out. Let's put in 1500. Look at the. Look at that. They got like a little trail that falls. Get mesmerized. You need to stop. Stop watching the butterflies. Okay. Um, what else do I have in my inventory? T2. I need to set that up at some point too. Explosive powder. Um, mutagen. Uh, alloy and aluminum can go. Super alloy and aluminum can go in here. So that can go there. You didn't craft anything. Okay. Aluminum. Alright. So I need another crafting. And that's two osmium and a super alloy. So super alloy rod. Right. Did I grab it? I did. Two osmium. And then I need three iron. There's two. Actually, I probably don't need one. What does the osmium rod take? All osmium. So I could probably just dump it. Let's see if this chest out here has one more iron. There we go. Take that. And then doorway in all the way around and I think I don't know if I can set one there but let's see it's gonna stick out isn't it it's 
Come on. And then let's stick the CM1 there. Oh, um, before we get to that, I put them all the way over here so they wouldn't interfere with the other chest. Um, so it looks like the other crafters and then some common larvae and the three chest. Sweet. So now let's set this for our osmium rods. Let's go get the osmium. Cool thing is of sulfur there. A lot of bio nugs now. And let's drop all that in there. Should start crafting. There it is. There's two. All right. So now we have all of our rod stuff being crafted over here, which is fine. Uh, we can definitely do that. And maybe that's what we do with some of our other stuff that we need to craft. Um, for example, um, this one here would be very easy to do over here. That one's out. Oh, we don't have that one set up outside yet. I'm going to set that up too. So let's go look at that really quick. Oh, I don't have any more iron. I think I might keep this episode a little shorter than the last ones. Um, so I have this route here. And then we have the beehives out here. So I'm thinking that we remove these, put a staircase down here and put, um, oh, like some more of this here, um, down. And then we put, um, maybe a couple of beans and then, um, like four of those bee things. I think they also give you plants and insects yeah and I think we're far enough away still before we get the beehive too right let's just look at that together uh so it looks like our next thing at 10 GTI 10 more GTIs is the fusion energy cell and then after that it's the drones that will be freaking amazing um, then we have aquariums and then we can make circuit boards and pulsar quartz. Pulsar quartz, we should be able to do that in the other room too, because I think, um, from what I may have read is these are all the higher tier mineable resources. So we already have them going over to the other side. So um, if our rods are already full then it could start making pulsar quartz water life collector we need this it's 155 i think this is what we get the fish eggs and the photoplankton from so we still got 113 ppms left um mutagen three this one i can't wait for the extractor um, so it looks like you can select what horse. Is that a super alloy one? Sounds like it. Let me get slammed. Oh, super alloy. Okay. Um, so let's talk about um, the plans for in here. So I think I'm just going to move everything down to one. One chest in here and then try to fit them all in here um, because I was keeping two of these around only because I was needing to have to craft and I didn't want to keep running out so if I was already out there I might as well I didn't want to have to keep running back and forth so I think a lot 
lot of these we're just going to go down the run because before too long we're going to have the drums, right? And they're going to do a lot of the work for us. Um, so I think I'm going to move all the storage down to one. And then any overflows will go into uh, their own kind of rooms. But we'll only have one room for all of it. And from here, what we'll do is we'll divide this out. So alloys will be in one section. These bioplastic nuts. So like maybe your tier one stuff. I don't think super alloys really tier one. We'll just say all of our, you know, uh, resource eggs here. And then uh, aluminum will go into one. My hope is to get everything to go into one area. Um, divide it out into sections uh, and then we just go one place to pick up the resources but we're gonna have auto crafters set up I still have quite a bit of power um, check our power I am at 6095 so I still have quite a bit of power left but I think I'm gonna do it just like I've been doing here where I'll have it set up for silk to be produced and then we'll have uh, fabrics so I'll go ahead and make a cabinet for silk so we can keep a cabinet of silk if we need to but the fabric will be there also um, circuit boards will be made um, but we're gonna go down to one of these cabinets uh, I kind of like where it's at but um, which you know, this is all made stuff, so. Um, I think. Uh, that's what I will work on for the next episode. So I'll just consolidate all this. I won't bore you guys with it. Um, but I also have a room that goes through here now. So I need to move these anyway. Um, and then all of this overflow stuff is going to like disappear. Um, because we're not going to need it. It's just either going to sit in the crafter or it's going to go into, um, cabinet. So, um, I think the last thing we probably want to do is, um, I think there's four rockets, right? Yes, four rockets. So I think as the last part that I want to do, um, can I take all of you now? And I want to put you in here. I'm going to keep the microchips in here only because it's close to that. And we already know where that's at. So, and let's take all of you and put you all in this cabinet for now. I can't fit you all. Okay. Um... Yeah, I, I need to get that set up. High quality food. So, I can put one more in there. And you're going to go in here. And let's go ahead and put the worm in there for now. Um, I want to go ahead and get the rockets done. So, I think uh, we do all those. I think I got rid of all the super alloy though. Uh, but we're going to take these down by one. So, um, I think it's two a piece. So one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Um, and then one of them takes circuit board. Or I think two of them take bark and a tree lerma or not a lerma, this lerma seed. I think uh, they take that. I think can't remember if some of them take the fertilizer, which I have a bunch. I'm trying to go off the top of my head what all. Um, I can't remember if we use those or not. Let's go check. And then we'll launch some rockets here. And let's see. 
Uh, so bacteria mutagen. That one's ready to go. Silicon cobalt. So three silicon, three cobalt. Two, four. I was right on those. I, I did grab two tree bark, didn't I? Yes. So bacteria mutagen. Three silicon, three cobalt. Okay. Need a bacteria, which is in here. There's two cobalt. Silicone might be my hard one because. Oh no, I can just take it out of here. Wait, what do I keep doing that for? Because we're gonna go down. And a cobalt over here. Oops. Cobalt. Silicon and a mutagen, I think was the last one. So let's grab a mutagen. There we go. And then lumps rock from rocket. And then we're like halfway to the rocket thing that I wanted. I want to get to 10 each. So let's go ahead and do the seed spreader. And watch. Go, rock and go. Go. Go, go. And we'll wait for that to get far enough. Craft the next one. Plants rocket. And then magnetic field one. And then we'll wait. And yes, I know this is going to do the um, uranium or iridium, but oh, iridium. It's like perfect timing. And are you far enough? Let's go. Go, Rocky, go. Now that does 5,000. Let's see if that helps speed things along. Twenty-three. It's a study. Definitely need more insects. Really gotta get that going. Gotta get that going. But, all right. So I have my work cut out for me for the next episode, so I'm going to work on that and then get it all consolidated down to one area, one, one cabinet for each one. Because like I said, we're going to go ahead and this here is probably going to be all, looks like that's further back than all the other ones. That's weird. Oh, is it because this is a or living area that's a single um but i think i'll put the um pulsar quartz one here should pull from all of these um and then we'll i'll go ahead and get that all set up also um but it really doesn't matter what chest it goes in uh, this is just a dump all so Aluminum's there for the super alloy thing. But anyway, that's what I will work on for the next episode. So, with that, um, oh, let's talk about the transporter. Um, I think uh, we'll work on the transporter for the next one uh, because I want to do some exploring. And by exploring, we got a whole bunch of areas that I don't think I've 
went to. I think this is what's known as the crater area. Um, and I don't think I've been there yet. So I want to get here. Um, so what I'm thinking is our base is here. Is I would like to set up maybe an area up here. Uh, maybe around our uranium or something. Uh, and then set down a building and put a transporter in it. And then same way, maybe... Oh, look at that. You can see. Um, I didn't know that did that. Um, maybe set one down here. Um, for uh, the crater area. Really want to get to the crater area on the next one, so... Um, we'll set that up. Um, probably need one... I'm thinking maybe if I set one here, we can get to both of these, the waterfall and the the uh, crater area. Um, I want to see what's in here, but I really want to explore along here. Uh, so we'll need to set something up maybe down here. And maybe something over here. Um, that way we're not running all over the place. So... Um, we will see, but that's the plan. So I'll do like four buildings and then um, we'll put a transporter down. So um, you guys let me know where the transporter should go in this base. I'm thinking it probably needs to be a little more central. Uh, I don't know. Do we set it here against this? This may not be a bad area because this is like our control room area. So maybe we set it here. Um, I have this uh, incubator here, so... Oh, something else. These are all going to go away. Um, and we're just going to go down to the one foods in here. Um, because we're going to do all outdoor garden areas. So I think I'm going to keep the ones against the wall. But I'm going to get rid of everything that's here in the field. And then um, I can use these to replace some of these that I've already done. So I've got those sets and those sets and that should be enough. To replace all those. Um, so that'll help eliminate all this. Um, plants and things like that. I think I'm just going to move the whole plants and tree bark. We'll go down to one tree bark. Uh, only because uh, we'll, we can set this I think for the drones to pick up and then take it to it so we won't need any of this in here so I think what I might end up doing is uh, we'll probably need a lot more of these pulse, um, fusion generators and we'll just send them down this hall um, the plants we're going to need some just for that one but again I think I'm going to get them all combined into one so we're not running all over the place um, because eventually we're not going to have to the drones are going to do it for us so we just need to go to one storage area and then use it right so that's the thought that's what i'm gonna work on for the next one and then uh you guys by the time you see it we'll see a new storage area okay all righty um well hello iridium i'm glad you're here because then i can just drop you off You're, you're, you're polluting my area. Oh, I still haven't figured out what I'm going to do here. So I'll take any suggestions you guys have down in the comments below. Uh, let me know what you guys think. So let's drop that in there. There we go. Alrighty. I will see you guys on the next one. And as always, remember, be creative. Bye.